Hi, you with Canon Advisors weekly update for October 19th, 2022. In Alabama, the window to request a cannabis business pre-application form closed on Monday, October 17th with over 600 applicants. Now, the applications themselves will be sent to the applicants on Monday, October 24th. So the due date for the applications is December 30th, and the regulatory requirements we've seen thus far are very extensive. Now, this means that applicants will have a short window to prepare and submit all of the required information. So it's essential that all those applicants be active now and prepare what they can based on the current regulations until the application itself becomes available this upcoming Monday. It's less than three weeks until the November midterm elections uh, with adult use legalization on the ballot for five states being Arkansas, Maryland, Missouri, North Dakota, and South Dakota. And this is valuable as there will be upcoming business opportunities in these states over the next few months and years. Now, the most important thing you can currently do is to be an advocate register to vote, vote, campaign, and support cannabis-friendly candidates. Once the initiative passes, it's wise to start preparing your business planning and building out your core team. Nevada's Consumption Lounge license applications opened October 14th and closed on October 27th, and there will be opportunities for new applicants to get into this market. Also, Nevada's consumption lounges are set to be uniquely successful as they actually sell cannabis products from within the establishment. So if you're trying to get a consumption license in Nevada, feel free to reach out to us and we'll be happy to give you the rundown. And the application is relatively short and there are minimal qualifications, but don't forget you have to go to Carson City to submit your fees. In Rhode Island, regulators began accepting applications for medical cannabis dispensaries that want to become hybrid retailers with recreational sales. Adult use sales are expected to start in December, and additional licensing should happen in 2023. So this is important for potential new operators who are waiting for regulations and application details because it will motivate regulators to create rules and the, for the adult use market. And our advice is to watch for when the governor appoints the three members to the Cannabis Control Commission, since that will signal the beginning of the new rulemaking process. So this should be, in a sense, your starting gun to get your business preparations going if you aren't already. Also, Summer and Russ spoke at the Cannabis Quality Conference in New Jersey, and Jay and Bob are currently in New York City with the Arcview Cannabis Investment Summit. And in November, you can catch the Canada team at MJ BizCon. So reach out if you'd like to meet up there. Well, thank you very much for tuning in and we look forward to next time. Take care, everyone.